Good morning, friends. I hope you all had a great three-day weekend, and I hope you got to get outside and enjoy some of the snow that fell. I know not much fell at my house, but I saw some pictures of some of you guys that were out in the snow where you live, so hopefully you got to get out and have some fun. Today, I'm going to read you a story called Snow, and it's going to tell us a little bit about snow, where it, come, where it comes from, what it's made of, so this story will be an informational story. It's going to teach us something. So at the end, think about what did you learn about snow? This story, Snow, was written by Marion Dane Bauer and illustrated by John Wallace. It says the winter world is cold. The trees are bare. The grass is brown. Gray clouds crawl across the sky. Clouds are crystals of ice. Each bit of ice clings to a speck of dust. The specks of ice and dust cling to one another. They grow so heavy that they drop far up above from the cloud. And they make snow. When the air is very cold, the snowflakes stay small and bright. But when the air is not so cold, the flakes grow soft and larger and larger. They grow big enough to catch on your mitten and sometimes even on your tongue. Each snowflake has six sides. We learned about that in math, boys and girls. A shape that has six sides is called a hexagon. They come twirling to the earth in a billion different shapes. Wow. A billion, that's a lot. Snow dresses the trees and covers the grass. Snow keeps the flowers warm through the long winter. It's kind of like a blanket for your flowers. When spring comes, snow melts into puddles. And into those puddles, they go into the rivers and then into lakes and gives the earth a fresh, cool drink. But while winter is here, snow makes the cold world beautiful. And so much fun. On this page, it's gonna tell us a little bit more about the snow. It says the temperature has to be 32 degrees or colder for the water in the clouds to turn to ice, which turn into snow. Every snowflake can contain 50 crystals of ice. Wow. It says trillions and trillions of snowflakes fall in a single storm. That's a lot of snowflakes. And when we have strong winds, with heavy snow, that's called a blizzard. Not like the one you get at Dairy Queen, but a blizzard is a winter storm. And it says clouds can make snow even in the summer. What? Yeah, but it says because the summer air is close to the earth is warm, the snow turns into rain by the time it reaches us. Wow, I didn't know that, boys and girls. I learned something new too. And I hope you also learn something new about the snow. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day, my friends.